Well, 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 what do you know? We jump it right back into more of the Walking Dead series. We're going to continue off uh, where we last left off on episode four for season three for the Walking Dead. Hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. I had to jump right back into this and get away from the frustration of God during Saints Row, uh, the reboots. I couldn't play that game no more. And what's funny is Volition, they tweet out saying they know the issues and they're going to work on it. It's like, like nobody really cares anymore. Somebody said this game is going to die within a week. And it's been out since a week so far, since last Tuesday. And it's just, nobody's playing this game anymore. I mean, you got people playing it beating already. It's, it's just ridiculous. What happened to Saints Row? Just remaster Saints Row 2 and just get over with. It's like, come on, man. When nobody cares about the reboot anymore. I mean, I don't. But hope y'all just keep doing what you're doing. If y'all want the rest of this game, let me know in the comment section. We're going back into a real series with a real storyline. But if y'all want more of this game, you already know, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. I've noticed that the last part of Warzone just blew up in views for some reason. Don't know where that came from. But if y'all want me to keep spending more Warzone content, let me know. And also, stay subscribed and also share the channel with others so we can grow together. Let's get to 20,000 by the end of the year. Let's work on that. Let's get started. Here we go. All right, guys, we're jumping right back into it. All right, be merciless if needed. Trust the right people. What do you mean, All right, here we go. Not everybody in New Richmond is bad. Some of them can be trusted. Seems like it's hard to know who to trust. It's not easy. Even your father got fooled. Who was that? Oh, was those enemies? I forgot where they was going, y'all. I forgot. Um, it's it's been about a week. I uh, literally forgot the storyline for a minute. How do we know if we can trust him? We can't. But that doesn't mean we can just kill him. Okay. We don't want to make any noise and attract any attention. Hey, I can go talk to him while you sneak inside. I'll distract him. You won't do anything to me. It's a good idea, Gabe. I, I can do this. Gabe, go and distract him so we can get in there. Hey! Oh, hey. I saw something. Show me. Hurry, right, Poppy, get in there. Hurry up. Get inside the room. Good, he did not expect the thing, so let's go inside. What, they were going to a hospital or something? I guess, oh, armory door. I think we had to steal weapons. Alright, let's look. Oh snap. Oh, that's just Gabe. Never mind. We're good. <sighs> Told you it would work. Good work, buddy. It's down here. The guns are through that door. Locked. No time to look for a key either. I have to do this the hard way. All right, gotta use a fire extinguisher to, to bust the door open. Here we go. They're not gonna hear it. I mean, that's the only way to get through it. Come on. Dang, that thing's loud. Holy crap. All right, one more bus through. Here we go. Let's get it. Nice. We did it. Hey, look at that armor in here. It's like a Call of Duty gunsmith. Put 
Put these in your bag. Taking all the ammunition, Viper ammunition. Oh, we look like we're about to go on a shootout. We never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle nephew one two punch. Yeah, we do. Drop it. What the hell are you doing here? What are you doing with all that? Trying to help. I know you're pissed at me, but I want to do the right thing. For your brother. For him, for the rest of my family, for everyone. Yeah. It was a shit thing to do, fucking off on me like that. I know. I... Why didn't you meet me at the stronghold? We had a plan. My brother is in over his head and the water is rising. He needs our help. You're damn straight he does. But why should I trust you now? As far as I can tell, you're nothing but trouble. David would want you to. He needs fighters. We're his only hope. You're right. He doesn't have anyone else left in his corner. Your heart's in the right place, I'll give you that. Okay. You know I'm in. And it looks like you could use all the help you can get. Awesome. I gotta grab something else real quick. Meet me by the front at five. Okay. Oh, snap. Get, get back. Get back. Hurry up. Come here. We get spotted. Is that that guard that we saw? Yep. I think. No, oh, my guy's but Freeze! Shoot him. We gotta get him. Get away from him. Oh, snap. How are we supposed to stop that? All right. Lady got stabbed in the shoulder. Javi, you're bleeding. Are you okay? Oh my God. I'll be fine. Are you sure? I'm so sorry. Yes, I'll be fine. Don't worry about it. We have to get back to the others. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody sees him. Oh, well, oh. I didn't know I, I could move with the jo uh, joystick. I was like, what the heck? I thought it froze for a minute. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No. It's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facility is right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay. But let's be quick. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? Clem? Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Thought you'd be long gone by now. <sighs> so did I. But I still need to talk about AJ with Lingard. Look at him. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. 
Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. All right. Go for it. But if I lose my arm, that's on you. Ha ha. You'll be fine. I've dealt with worse. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. <clears throat> Clem. Are you okay? I'm fine. I started bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. It means you're growing up, blossoming into your, you know, like, womanhood. Your body is, is developing, and then things change, but it'll be okay. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. She's going through some changes, that's what is happening. Alright, we gotta talk to Lingard. Uh, slap. Why don't we slap that dude? Let's look around for a minute. See if there's anything we can pick up. Wait, actually, let's go and talk to him. Let's see what he has to say. All right, anyway, shoot. What you got, man? Up. Talk to me. Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Can you hear me? Does he look like he can hear you? Oh, never mind. Anyway, let's go ahead and see what's in these cupboards. You mean cabinet? Why did, why did they sit like that? Anyway. Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. All right, that ain't it. Let's look in the medical kit. Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. I have to patch myself up in a minute. All right, let's look at the... What is this? In this drawer? Here we go. Got some gauze pass. And then capsule bottle. We need something to so he won't get infected. Just pills. It's not gonna work either. Alright, so the only thing I can think of is probably slapping the dude so it can work. Alright, that's probably the only thing. Let's try. Wake up. Talk to me. Wow. That guy is really out of it. You can't even feel that. Uh, then what are we supposed to do then? I mean, do I, I guess I gotta keep searching around then. Let's check this cabinet. Because we gotta wake him up. And let's put water on him. Cody. Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. Codeine tablets? Take the pills, put them back. Nah, I would put them back. No thanks. That's codeine, Gus. That's the purple drink. No, I'm just kidding. Uh. Nothing else. Only thing I could think of is. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. Think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay, hold still. Try not to breathe. Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. You weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Kenny used to say 
I was a natural born mother. It's a butterfly. <laughs> Goofball, want another? <laughs> Which one to do next? Hmm. How about... Uh... Oh, wait. I didn't mean to decide. Dang it. I was too late. Always used to do that one for Duck. He'd laugh his ass off. Oh, shit. Hey, grab the lighter out the duffel, will you? All right, so let's see. Light. All right, let's light this side first. Burn that side, and then we burn the right side of the campfire. All right, that should do it. Just a second, goofball. Voila. Hey, get away from him! No snap. Don't mess up the bun commands. Or we'll be too late. Is he okay? You know, first time I saw you holding AJ, it just looked so natural. Somewhere up there, his mama is looking down on you. Grateful for what you're doing. Always putting him first. She called me family. I owe it to her. You're the only mama he's got now. Protective, loving, caring. All the things a good parent needs to be, and all at your age. But parenthood is a hell of a motivator, though. <laughs> That's for sure. That kind of love. It brings out the best in us. I felt it with Lee. Yeah, he was a good man. Well, I could have treated him better. I know that now. Ooh. Kids as sick of the cold as I am. So I've been thinking. It's no use surviving out here, hoping that Wellington will take us in someday. I bet we find some good people down in Florida. Maybe even a little friend for this goofball. Wouldn't that be nice? We could use the company. AJ could use a friend his own age. I remember when you and Duck used to color together back at the motel. Helped him forget about all this. For a moment, anyway. I'm sure it helped you, too. Life doesn't mean much without people you can relate to. Sarita always said, family what you make it she was right I'm sorry for all this sappy shit I guess I'm just happy we're family Kenny all of us all right all right all right enough sap Kenny <laughs> How about this one, little man? <laughs> We've got each other. As long as we have that, we'll be okay. All right, so this is one month later. So does it just keep going or is it?
All right, come out. Who's there? Draw a knife. What I'm gonna do, y'all? I'm gonna stop the video here. Then continue the next part. So love y'all. Let's keep doing what you're doing. If y'all want some more gameplay of this, let me know in the comment section. I gotta leave y'all with a cliffhanger. I don't wanna make these episodes too long, so it'll take forever to upload. But nah, if y'all want more, I already know what to do. It's good to come back to a good story mode game. I'm just saying. Anyway, let me stop talking about Saints Row. Anyway, catch y'all on the next part.